Hey, I'm Omar from Omar's BI blog. And today we're gonna to take a look at another lead code problem so that you can ace that next interview. All right, let's get into it. So here we are with the lead code medium. It's an algorithm question. I'm gonna complete this in Python. <laughs> I'm gonna complete this in Python here. Right, so let's take a look at the question. Um, so we're gonna we're gonna be provided a input string. So let's take a look at the example here. In this example, we have a string, the sky is blue. And the expectation is that we return that same string in reverse order. So instead of the sky is blue, we're going to return blue is the sky. There's a couple other caveats. If I take a look at another example, we have this one here that is hello world with leading spaces and uh, world with uh, trailing spaces. And the expectation is that you have hello space world. And that is your solution. And lastly, we have another one, a good example. There's some leading or trailing spaces, depending on how you look at it here. And those should all be cleaned up. Uh, so as I've mentioned in the past, the most important thing to do when you're coding is to take a look at the problem at hand and come up with a uh, plan of attack. Uh, so this is my plan here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to initially take this string and I'll just drop it here, for example. Uh, so I have the sky is blue and my plan is to reverse this so that we end up with so I end up with this string here, the sky is blue, but backwards, uh, and I'm gonna split this into a list. So I'll end up with something like this uh, in a list. And then from there, I'll iterate through this list here. So then what I'll, what I'll do here is I'll, I'll create a variable string and iterate through each of these and reverse the strings. So then I'll end up with uh, blue is sky the. Okay, so let's put that plan into effect. Get started. So initially, I know I'm going to need a string. So let's just put that in. Now I'm going to define that as an empty variable. Okay, great. Uh, so I'm going to have to uh, iterate through the list that's provided. So the the list provided is S. Uh, so let's iterate through that. As I mentioned, I want to put these in reverse. So what I'll do is I'll go through this backwards and I'll also split or not backwards in reverse, excuse me. And then I'll also split this into a list based on a space. So I'll end up with that second step of the sky. Um, blue is the sky with a word as well being backwards. Uh, what this does not solve for is these leading spaces that you see here. So I'm going to have to solve for that. Uh, but for now, let's just go through the through the motions here. Um, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to append the string that I have above the my R string variable. And I'm going to strip any spaces uh, from either end, uh, because as we see here, we're going to have leading or trailing spaces. So I'll strip those out. And then I'll add in Uh, the current uh, item in the loop. So let's add that in. Okay, great. So what this is going to end up doing is going to give me a, a sort of a concatenated string as it loops through and it's going to uh, reverse the string in the right uh, order. So that I end up with um, blue is the uh, blue is sky the. So what I want to do is I want to return uh, my R string. Uh, but the last thing to note is uh, we're going to want to clip any trailing or leading uh, spaces because we have examples like this. So let's try that here. Okay, great. So what I'll do is I'll quickly just run the code, make sure that everything is good to go. And there it is. Sky, uh, uh, blue is sky that. All right, so let's submit this here and uh, see how, how it stacks. All right, there it is. So I've submitted the, uh, the code and it's 75% uh, faster than other uh, solutions. So again, the most important thing to think about when you're uh, working through some of these leak code problems or any other general uh, coding algorithm is to come up with a plan of attack where you're going to start, how you're going to execute, and then uh, ultimately where it's going to finish. I hope you enjoyed the video. Be sure to like, subscribe, uh, leave some comments. Let me know if you came up with a different solution. I uh, appreciate it.
See you next time.